Jake has been in the next man mentality this whole camp because of one of the defensive leaders that ended up being booted off the team earlier this summer. Here's what Jake had to say. You know, that's an experienced player stepping away, but that's going to open up the door for other opportunities moving forward. So, as a group, we just got to grow closer together. Some younger guys are going to have to step up and fill that void. And uh, I think we got a solid group in the defensive backfield. And, you know, we've had a good six days of camp, but looking forward to the next couple of weeks of leading up to game one. As a leader, have you, have you taken even more of a role? I asked Monty the same thing. Have you guys kind of stepped it up just knowing that there's one last veteran guy? Yeah, definitely. You know, in the defense backfield, we're pretty young right now. Um, between, you know, myself, Monty Hooker, uh, Michael Jamudia. We got to bring along those younger guys. We got a lot of guys in the, it's the first time playing college football. Got to get them ready to go because they're going to be playing on Saturday. So um, just take on that role as a leader. It's, it's challenging at times, but at the same time, you know, I take pride in it. I look forward to it. And, uh, you know, I'm excited for my fifth and final year. Can you believe that it's already, this is it for the black and gold, this next, the next 12, 13 games? No, it's really crazy. You know, when you're a freshman, you know, you always hear the seniors say, it's going to go by like that. It's going to go by in the blink of an eye. You kind of brush it off, you don't think about it, and then it seems like you, you know, fall asleep at night, wake up, and it's four and a half years later. It's crazy how fast it goes by. Um, you know, I've, like you said, I've had some ups, I've had some downs, but I'm just really trying to take in this fifth and final year, do everything I can to help our, our team win games and add value to our team, and uh, I'm really excited for this, this last year. How does it feel going from, going from, I guess, you know, walk on to now the most veteran guy, one of the leaders on the defense? How, do, how does that progression, I guess, like, do you even realize that? Do you, do you step back and think about it? I mean, what's... Uh, not really. You know, I'm still in the mix of it. I think later on I might step back and look at it, but... Uh, it just all comes down to, you know, hard work, you know, putting in the time, putting in the effort, whether it's, you know, on the field, in the weight room, or in the classroom. If you do things right, you know, stuff is going to work out for you. And uh, I've tried to do that these, these past four and a half years. And like I said, I'm just really looking, looking forward to this, this first game against NIU the rest of the season and uh, just putting on the black and gold for the next 12, 13 games. Where did you want to improve individually the most? Definitely just in terms of playing, you know, reading run pass faster so I can fill, fill the hole in a run game or just knowing some, some routes they might run uh, based off the formation and personnel. But uh, the biggest thing for me personally is just, you know, communication. The, the, the more vocal I am, the more confident I make calls, it's not only going to help me play faster, but it's going to help everybody else on the field make play faster. So if we're playing faster, we're going to play better, we're going to play together, we're going to make more plays and, you know, hopefully get the ball back to our offense. So I think communication has been something I focus on and I'm trying to do that day in, day out in camp and do that the next couple weeks leading up to game one. How about as a defense, as a unit entirely? Where, you know, I'm sure communication is obviously a big part of that too, but where were there some aspects where, you know, may, maybe made a priority to, to really shore that up? Um, just the biggest thing we focus on as a defense is no big plays. You know, if we give up big plays, they're going to score a lot of points. That's going to make it harder for our offense to, you know, or for our team to win games. So, um, like you said, though, communication, that goes from the D-line to the linebackers to the back end. It's the biggest thing we focus on during practice. we got to clean up anything, you know, we make mistakes, clean up in the film room, not let it happen again on the field. So I think we got, you know, a real veteran group up front in the D-line that's going to lead the way. Um, we got some young guys at linebacker that got to step up and then got some, some experience in the back end. But, you know, I think so far through camp, I like where we're at. We've got a lot of room to improve these next two weeks. Any shuffling? You, Lamani, I guess Brandon would have been a... Have you part moving down into the box, moving around? Have you been a part of that discussion? Or? I think it's going to change week by week. I don't want to give anything away, but uh, we've got some guys that can fill some roles with uh, Amani Hooker's athleticism. You know, we can shuffle him around, put him in some man situations, drop him down um, on a slot receiver, stuff like that. So that's going to open up some doors for our defense to be, uh, be in better positions against certain teams, certain personnels, and uh, we'll see how it goes. But right now, it's just focusing on the fundamentals, keeping it simple, playing our defense the best we can, and improving day in and day out. And the last thing, how do you have a successful season? How would can be any way you want to measure. How do you deem, deem it to be successful? Uh, just do everything I can to help our team win. Leave it all on the field. I'm going to make mistakes. I'm going to get beat. That's going to happen as far as sports. Just being able to flush those mistakes, be able to move on to the next play. And like I said, do everything I can to help our team win games.